cylinder. In this video, we will learn what a cylinder is and how to find its volume and surface area. This video was made for you. Let's start it. A cylinder is a solid that has two parallel faces, which are congruent circles and one curved side. These two parallel faces form the bases of the cylinder. Look at the figure. The bases are circles, parallel and congruent. All cross-sections of a cylinder will be circles, parallel and congruent, just as the bases. If the side curved of cylinder is cut, opened out and unrolled onto a plane, it takes the shape of a rectangle. Pay attention in the figure. The curved surface is like the label around a tin of soap. It can be flattened out to make a rectangle. The surface area of a cylinder can be found by breaking it down into three parts as seen by its net. The two circles that make up the ends of the cylinder and the curved side of the cylinder, which when unrolled is a rectangle. The area of each base is given by the area of a circle. The lateral surface area is given by the product of a width and height. We can see that the width of the area is equal to the circumference of the circular base. To find the total surface area of the cylinder, we add the areas of the two circles to the area of the rectangle. Combining these parts, we get the formula. The volume of a cylinder can be calculated in the same way as the volume of a prism. The volume is the product of the base area times the height of the cylinder. Let's see how it works. A can of drink is the shape of a cylinder. The can has a radius of 4 cm and a height of 15 cm. Find the volume and surface area of the cylinder. Take the formula, change the values. The radius is 4 cm, the height is 15 cm. To find the volume, take the formula, change the values. It's done. Another example. Pay attention, it's a very good example.
If you enjoyed the content of this video, don't forget to subscribe. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask or suggest anything. I will be grateful for that.